So Bitcoin is sitting at 51,959, as you can see. And it did touch uh, 52,816. I still expect it to go a bit up, uh, um, to go a bit more. I think this thing can go up to 55k. Uh, but the moment that we were waiting for for all this long um, to find the top, and then finally start making our decisions, and then decide whether from there it's going to go to seventy thousand dollars, or whether it's going to go from there towards forty-four first, and then we can talk about the rest later. All that stuff will be decided now. Uh, we have been talking about this for more than five weeks now, uh, where I've been talking about the top and the and then the crash, <laughs> and the top that I've been looking for is finally coming into place. Uh, if this doesn't become top, then this should turn into a floor. It will become either of it. It's not going to be um, anything else <laughs> apart from that. It's either going to crash from there uh, when it is on the top or whether it's going to it's going to pump. The pump case scenario is very straightforward. You have more than, uh, let me check my telegram. So fortunately, I have a bot there. So having... So when I ask my bot, it um, starts generating the information I want. So you can see the halving information is shared. Uh, and it says 61 days and 4 hours. So 61 days are left, which means 2 months. And how we are going to keep things above um, $50,000 for 2 months, that is going to be extremely strange for me. I have never seen Bitcoin doing that <laughs> to, to get so bullish um, all of a sudden pump so hard and then continue to keep it like that. But anyway, that's a whole separate discussion. From here, if you are looking for a support, it is at $50,000. As long as $50,000 holds, your upper side story will continue, uh, which means that if you're looking for a rally, then $50,000 is a support and it can go up to 55. If you are thinking of it um, dropping out, then shorting a market like this is always very risky. That is something that you should keep in mind uh, when making a decision like that. So, um, but if you're looking for an exit, I think um, anywhere from 53 to 55K is a good range for an exit um, if you want to exit the market. But um, shorting comes with its risks um, because the overall plan is always to liquidate the shorts and the longs both. We will have fun with the longs when we break below 50k <laughs> but uh, for now it's a market against shorters so be on the lookout and be safe that's the overall scenario with bitcoin and this is the final showdown and we will see the top now now there are no more moves pending like i have been discussing for five weeks uh, making one video daily <laughs> so that is the case scenario so be on the lookout and be safe and it went to 52k almost. Uh, it touched 52k and it dropped. Anyway, so we will see it going there.